Hello everybody, hope you're having a wonderful day or evening wherever you are. My name is Bobby, welcome to my channel. If I didn't already say that, I am the emperor of the universe, my universe. It's the little universe here in my heart. Whew, um, downloads man, I'm getting them. I've had to ignore a lot and I'm, I apologize to God and the universe for that. But I've been trying to stay on point with a lot of stuff. This one's going to be about heroes and fools and goodness and righteousness and who's right and who's wrong and why are the people in charge all douchebags? I mean, I'm not even, I don't even fucking kidding. I'm not even kidding. They're all selfish, fucking greedy bastards, all of them, and bitches, all of them, all of them. I'm, I fucking, God is so pissed. I can't wait to see what he's going to do. Can't we see what the universe is gonna ha wrap these motherfuckers up? Who apologize? I just got done giving some food. I'm homeless, by the way. Not not in victim way, but you know, let's just be honest. I'm poor. Super. I'm one of the poorest. My bank account has five dollars and a little over five dollars. I have a dollar. I literally have a dollar and some change. And I just gave two gallons and of water and a bunch of canned food. To the guy that's still living out there in this car, who's mentally ill, he's been out here since I showed up over a month, beginning of February, beginning of March, and he was like, I asked him if he had a can opener to start with, and, uh, and he goes, no, and I go, I, and I have one, I brought one for him, I had an extra one. He goes, did you bring me food February a month ago or something? I was like, yeah. He goes, oh, thank you. I'm like, well, he remembered that. Interesting. And I just told him I have a wonderful day. Yeah, he's okay. And you see why I'm a little perturbed. Somebody, we need to get help. I'm going to figure something out. I'm going to talk to the local church or charity and figure out if we can't get him some help. Because he's just sleeping in the back of his vehicle. And it's just, no. That's just so fucked up. Anyway. Now you can see why I'm pissed off at the people in charge. They're all just scum. They're all fucking scum. I mean, not. I'm not even kidding. And not, this isn't from a point of view of like a Trump supporter or anybody supporter. I'm just in general disgusted with the people in charge of this planet. Period. End of fucking story. From Elon Musk to all of them to George Soros, that Nazi piece of shit. Whew, now you know why this isn't for kids. But like I said, I'm downloading. This is what God wants me to do. He wants to know who the heroes are. He wants to know who the good guys are. Because I'm not seeing any. I'm not seeing any good guys. I look at the news when I see the... All I see is bad guys trying to act like good guys when they're fucking horrible. And then you got actors. Who can act like any fucking way they want to. Except being real. Because that's got to be a scary fucking moment for them, huh? They can't be the superhero fucking badass spy. You got to be the douchebag that you are. The selfish rich prick. <clears throat> well, they, you know, none of these people care or they'd all be poor because they'd be giving away their money to poor bastards like this who need help, who need a facility, who, who can't be just left sleeping in this car. I can't imagine the kids. Don't get me started on fucking seeing homeless kids. It's just, that is just the fucking end all of just the sin of humanity and whew, I gotta do something, we gotta do something. Who's the heroes? Who are the heroes? Are you a hero? Do you want to be a hero? Did you give up on being a hero? I don't know why God wants me to bring this up. Oh, okay. <clears throat> What's that movie? The uh, with Sylvester Stallone. The I can't think of the name of it. The Expendables. And the first one with Jason Statham and all that, you know, a little violent, but Mickey Rourke is in the first one, but he doesn't, he doesn't go to battle, right? He doesn't, he's not shooting the guns. I think he's done killing people at that point. 
he's more like the priest. But he's hanging out with Sylvester Stallone, and he, and he needs some help. And basically, he's there. To, he's just showed up for some advice, and he's telling Sylvester Stallone uh, a point in his life when he could give a fuck about anything and anybody. He was in Bosnia or whatever, doing mission um, mercenary work, and he sees this lady about to jump off a bridge, and he knows she's gonna jump. She sees him, he sees her, right? The kind of thing. And instead of doing something, instead of giving a fuck, he turns around and acts like, you know, fucking don't care. And she jumps. So he's got to remember that and live with that every moment of his life. It's just a movie. But it's a powerful moment, right? Are you going to be the hero? Are you going to turn your back and let him just jump and not care? Deep, right? God can be deep. The universe can be very deep. Be the hero that I know you are. Hero is a female too. Her heroine, whatever. Wonder Woman. Badass. By the way, just on the side note, talk about jumping through puberty, right? Watching Wonder Woman on television as a seven year old? Shit. Forget about it. She was goddess. Anyway. I love you. God loves you. And the universe is crazy about you. And believe that you're a hero. So let's do it. Let's be heroes.